What's up everybody? It's your boy Meme here. Are you ready for the most crazy thing? Listen. Listen how silent that is. I hit something. Listen. Isn't that weird? And they go so far. They like really just like don't stop. <laughs> okay, they stopped there. But they wouldn't have stopped if I hadn't leaned forward. Uh, yeah, I got these rollerblade wheels in my chair, and, uh, they're really awesome, uh, and I love them a lot. Uh, if you ever need to get them, just look up, um, office chair, rollerblade wheel, caster, something like that. Um, yeah, they're very nice, and they add, like, an inch to the height of the chair, uh, which is great, because this chair is, like, particularly short. It was a little shorter than my last one, uh, and that was my big complaint with it. But, uh, I was thinking, you know, maybe I could add a piece of wood in between where the chair part and the base connects. But turns out I can actually just add a, um, uh, turns out I can actually just add these wheels and it's way taller. Uh, you can see what they look like. You can see they're just like singular wheels. Like they're basic, they're literally just full of wheels. Um, the only problem is they're a little, um, they're the type of plastic you can kind of like, they're, they're kind of like a, like a, sh like a, it's the type of plastic that stuff can really easily get stuck on, you know? You can expect it getting really dirty. Um, so, keep that in mind. So maybe they'll get louder in the future if your floor is dirty. But you know, with that new robot vacuum we've got, we're getting all these products now. Uh, I don't know why. Uh, with that new robot vacuum we got, you know, my floor won't be super dirty, so I won't get that much of my wheels. This is so cool. It's wild. Like, I remember, um, you know, in my um, old videos, as in my videos before this one, I, uh, whenever I rolled over to like the other side of my room and I was talking, you could not hear me at all as I was doing that. But um, I assume here, you can hear me just fine because, you know, the, we the wheels are fine. That's just wild. Like, this is silent. It's like weirdly quiet. <laughs> okay, I should stop doing it. Uh, for breakfast, I had a cheese bagel. For lunch, I had a. Uh, um, sorry, I got rolling. Took me out of my mind. Um, for lunch, I had uh, a sandwich and some uh, chicken nuggets that were at school. And uh, for dinner, we had cashew and pepe. Um, yeah. Tomorrow, I'm going to be sick. And I won't be able to show up to school. That's definitely not because of anything we're doing. Um, uh, it's definitely not because we have any restaurant reservations or anything. Um, so, I'll, I'm gonna be sick tomorrow at school. Uh, yeah. Um, you know, I'm doing really well. Crypto's way down. You know, I, I used to, I, I still mine on my computer because um, my, my whole philosophy is, right, um, like I don't want for 12 hours of the day my computer to be doing nothing, right? And even if crypto is like, um, you know, bad for the environment, right? It's one computer doing it for like 12 hours a day. And it's just so then, I don't know, I can get some money that could possibly increase in value. But obviously that last part is not the case. Uh, right here, I don't know if you can see this, as 0.3 USD daily. It used to be like $2 daily um, in mining, but um, the price just decreases over time. Um, well, the daily price decreases over time depending on how much Ethereum is, right? And uh, you know, normally it's, you know, when I started mining, it was like $2. Um, a day usually, uh, but now it's at like three cents, uh, thirty cents, which is crazy. Uh, it's all still free money. I don't really care if the price goes down, like, but the daily price, um, it's all free money, you know. Uh, yeah, yeah. Man, I gotta do this one more time. It's so quiet. It's so like oddly quiet. You know what, I'll, I'll put the ones I got in the description, but I found some ones that were like literally the exact same product, except that had like a different product name on them. Um, and I think you can get those and you'll get the exact same product for like $10 cheaper. But I'll get the exact product I got, I'll put that in the description. It'll be an Amazon US link, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but all my views are from the US except for one. So, you know, take of that what you will.
It's actually funny, all my viewers who aren't the person from the US know me in real life. Um, you know who you are. Uh, must be odd to be referenced like that. That must be crazy. Um, I need to get better fitting clothes. You know, I'm actually rather, like, I used to not be very skinny. I'm rather skinny, right? Well, I'm not skinny skinny. I'm not so skinny where someone told me to eat a sandwich. But, you know, if you look at my videos from, like, like two years ago, I'm, like, way heavier. I used to be, like, 200 pounds. I'm, like, 170 now, which is wild. Um, and, you know, of course, you know, I don't know. All these clothes, This is, these clothes aren't from back then. But, you know, I've always just defaulted to getting large size just everything, right? Um, you know, not just soda, but, uh, you know, just, like, clothing and stuff. And I realized that, um, I realized that maybe I should be doing that. Maybe I should get, be getting mediums or something. I just gotta look at sizing charts and stuff. I just gotta measure, like, how much my diameter is and stuff. The only problem is that, you know, it's really easy for your weight to increase, not very easy for your weight to decrease, right? And so, if I start buying medium clothing, to still be able to fit in this medium clothing, I'd have to, uh, um, stay at my weight. That'll probably be pretty easy. All right. Uh, yeah, see you, dude. This video is like my longest video in a while, just because I'm rolling around in a chair. All right, see you, dude.